and is speaking, when they find that they are speaking, they move around. So that's why it ensures that they come there. That's why they move around. We have the longer pants because we know it times the girls that are having to go in night. There's, there's a longer pants for them to go in This is our boosters. And the booster, like I said, is attached for them to go in So with your heavy flow, just attach your booster like that, my boy. Attach your booster and there you go. It's heavy, you remove it, put it into your zipper bag. To some of you guys, this might look disgusting and uh, I'm not going to do it. Yes, it's fine. But to some of this, it's saving a lot of girls. There are many girls. That's why you can find most, most of the girls that have dropped out of school because they can't anymore. We're looking about people. Imagine if you can't even buy your bread, how can you afford a bread? How much are pets now? They are about more than $20. And the cheaper pets are the ones that can give you infections because it's made of material that can cause infections because girls are very sensitive. Our skins in general are very sensitive. Most of these cheaper pets can even cause cancer to you. So this pet can be used up for three years. I tried it out. We had to test them. They are very comfortable. These pets are very comfortable, number one. You don't even feel like having a pet. And with them, because of the waterproof layer inside, there's no leak. There is no leak. It doesn't leak like the other beds. Even if it's full, you have a booster motor. So the booster needs to get full and then the bed. Not where as other beds once it just gets full. Like I said, to some of you it might be discussing, but to some, this is changing a girl's life. We went deep into a room room where people were even crying. Because people can't afford beds. And imagine for three years you don't buy beds. Isn't that amazing? Huh? For three years, you don't have to buy pets because they work for three years if you take good care of them. So this is what we'll be teaching you guys to make. Some of the boys that I am actually happy that we have some boys because this is what our girls go through. This is what your sisters go through. And you have girls in the north, up in the north. They do not have brothers that can... Or some of them, the parents pass and they stay with their brothers. And like I said, to some boys this might be disgusting, but to some boys, né, they enjoy this. Because they are being educated about pets, menstruation, and that's how they can teach their sisters. At times now you know how to understand your girlfriend. That oh, it's that time of the month. This girl is in pain. Let me not bother. Let me move. Huh? <laughs> Don't <laughs> say I. Yeah, just exaggerating. Ah, what is serious is nothing. Oh, my God, we go through pain. So by doing the workshop, we'll be teaching the boys as well. We talked about periods basically, menstruation. What happens? In so, when I went the other time, two weeks ago when I was there, um, I met some people from the sun community. Now those people, they work with the moon. Okay? Those hunter gatherers, the sun people, sun community, they do not wear clothes and stuff like that. Almost like the Himas, but just the koi, they speak with the clicks. Okay? We met up with two ladies and they were telling me that they work with the moon. Not which crap guys. They work with the moon in the sense of when the moon is a certain time, they know when they get their periods. They don't work with calendars like we do. <coughs> they would know the body feels like this, and the moon is like this, I'm getting my periods tomorrow. And they get their periods tomorrow. They even know their periods to a point, né? they don't use pads, because they don't wear panties at all. Né? They wear the cloth, the thing around them, the animal skin. Né? So those ladies, what they, they then do is, they could dig a hole in the ground. And they know themselves, they know their bodies, they know when the blood will flow. So then they could sit in that hole until it's time. They move like it's normal. Then they will feel, you no, know, it's going to come now. Dig a hole, so the blood continues. That's how much they know their bodies. Would you be able to do that? <laughs> exactly. You see how interesting it gets. So we can even try to see to get one of the people from the Sun community to come join our workshop. Just to educate us on this. But now what they have done, because most of these ladies now, because the thing is the people refuse to be close. And you can't force them. Is their belief, is their culture. But now some of them are becoming modern to where they are starting to wear reusable sanitary pads. And now they made a very nice reusable pad. I actually wanted to see it. It's a very long one. Ne? It's very, very long because they wear ropes around their waist, just like the Oshibabu people wear ropes. They also wear those. Because, because people and then they are deep stitched, but they are away. So sometimes we give you a just, just to take away the tape. So that's basically how it works. There is also. Um, uh, pain medication you are given after the procedures you do from time to time feel a little bit discomfort. Take those tablets um, three times a day, 
So basically, you recover, especially for boys, the recovery is very quick. By three weeks, you already recover, but we prefer you should uh, wait for six weeks for you to be fully recovered. But uh, by the fourth day, already the wound is starting to dry up, you don't feel any pain. So mostly, uh, some boys get circumcised on the Friday, Monday they are back at school. So uh, it's not really something that you should stay home. So that's how it's done. And uh, I know many people uh, have thought that circumcision is done only in winter. Yes, it was done in winter because that was traditional. But if you listen carefully, I will check the term here, which says medical. Now, medical is something that's done in the hospital or a uh, private hospital. And they quickly they use magic uh, uh, for sure that you will recover very soon. So you can do it uh, in summer, autumn. Spring, winter, it's still the same with medical circumcision. But with traditional one, they normally take two to three months to recover. So with ours, it's just a month and two weeks. Whether you have done it in winter, uh, in summer, or uh, uh, spring, any season, you can do it. We are